Tell me what's wrong, what's going on? Guys, welcome back. If it's your first time here, go ahead and subscribe, thumbs up, blah, 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 all these good things, right? So, um, if you haven't read the title, let me just tell you what we're going to do today. I have, I have taken it upon myself to decide that the world needs to know my opinion about the all winners, all stars, season seven, drag race season. No one asked, but I noticed what y'all want. Also, it's Pride Month, so you know, what better way to support than to talk about, you know, something prideful. Already on season seven of All Stars, all right? So I just figured, let's go down the list. I'm gonna give you a little bit of thoughts. If you don't agree, let me know. If you do agree, also, you know, let me know that too. Let's just get right into the first queen. And in no particular order, other than the order that I found on Vulture, which is where I'm gonna be looking at these pictures, I'm gonna put them right over here. Anyway, so let's talk about Miss Jada Essence Hall. Jada Essence Hall. I, I'm, root, I'm rooting for Jada. I really am. I feel like so far in the competition, I feel like she's doing really well. She's had some strong looks. I'm, I'm here for it. I'm here for Jada. She is the pageant queen. I, I think that, um, not like the queen of queens now. Some people, this is them. I'm just saying, Jada, she she's she's giving it to me. Queen number two. Okay, Jinx Monsoon. Jinx is one of my favorite queens of all time. Okay, Jinx is one of my favorite queens, and I like just I like a campy queen. I like a funny queen. I like kind of like an awkwardness. I I really like that. That kind of drag really speaks to me. I I could see Jinx winning the whole thing now i know jinx has had a couple of hiccups so far in the season but it's still pretty early in the season and uh when she was not hiccuping she she was she was getting the girls right together so i i'm i'm here for jinx monsoon and i i do think jinx might be the one we have number three miss monet exchange let me tell you something about miss monet exchange honey 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 Miss Monet Exchange. Now, all the queens after winning their seasons have gone on to do wonderful, spectacular things. Even queens who didn't win Jack Drag Race went on to have really great, awesome, cool careers. And um, but Monet is really out here dipping it and doing it consistently. She stays booked and busy. Let me just tell you. Now, Monet didn't win her original season. But she won a season of All Stars, and now she is back again on another season of All Stars. You know, I I, I love Monet, but I feel like some she's distracted. Does anybody else feel like Monet is distracted on this season? It's like she's she seems sad, or she's she's not giving it to me. I don't know if she's scared because of the competition. I don't know. Is something going on? Did I miss something? Um, it's still time for, there is still some time for her to turn it around, but I don't, Monet, what's going on, babe? What's going on, babe? Like, you can bring it a little harder. I see more for you. Then we have Trinity the Tuck. Now, Trinity the Tuck is also the winner of All Stars 4 with Monet Exchange. They won together. It was a, and that's like the only co-win, I think, as far as Drag Race US in general. Somebody correct me in, in the comments below if I'm wrong. Um, Trinity the Tuck, uh, she's doing it. She's, she's doing, she's, she's confident. She's, she's bringing looks. She's turning tricks. She's, 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 she's doing it. This is somebody, Trinity, I could see coming and, and, and taking it again. I could see her taking the crown again. If she stays on this path now sometimes they start out real strong and then they fall off but you know what I'm saying? Raja okay we have Raja okay Raja won early on in season season three she won I love Raja Raja is definitely a fashion queen but Raja also has like this like she doesn't try to be funny but she's just naturally funny um but I like her just her aura, Raja is just so, 
like oh, just high class just like not bougie but like Raja just has like this je ne sais quoi you know what I'm saying it's just very unique but but I will say Raja as much as I love Raja's outfits and she's been doing pretty well in the challenges I, I want to see a different silhouette. Does anybody else feel like Raja always kind of has the same silhouette? While it is a great silhouette, and she she definitely turns looks, she definitely brings high fashion. Um, but uh, maybe she's gonna pull something out of the box. But right now, as far as the looks, her runways, I just I need something. I need, I need the next level Raja. Y'all get what I mean? I just, but it's there. I could see her being a, a, you know, sneaking up on the competition at the So now we have an international winner. We have uh, the Vivian. Now the Vivian was on Drag Race UK. Vivian, the Vivian, I'm impressed. I'm impressed with this one. Um... Do I think she's going to go all the way? I don't know yet. I can see it going both ways. But as far as looks and comedy, I I don't know. And, and the lip sync. She's a she's pretty good lip singer too. So, okay, the Vivian representing for the UK. So, Evie Oddly is another one of my favorite queens of all time. Evie is is. If you like weird, strange, out there drag, Evie is that one. Evie is so, it's just art. Evie is art. She's just weird and funny and uh, that she's definitely in her own lane. And I could see Evie winning it again. I could see Evie winning it again. I will say she was robbed in that one challenge when they did the court. I feel like she should have won. Um, I can't remember who won that competition. I, I, I'm like, okay, I see why that won. Did Jinx win that competition, that moment? Whoever won, or was it the Vivian? It was either the Vivian or Jinx who actually won that challenge. But I feel like Evie could have won, but her runway look. Her runway look was good, but if, if it was just a little bit more... I think she would have got that because of the acting challenge, man, she played that, man, she just, damn, she did that. So, look out for Evie. Look out for Evie. This is the last one we have. Shay Coulee. I like Shay. Shay is, is very professional. Shay is very uh, a classy. Um, Shay has, like, um a message behind her. I mean, all art has a message, but she has a very like socially aware, refined and, and, and you know, very structured queen. And she's a little serious. So I really like Shay, but I, I, I would like her more if she would just kind of let loose a little bit, like, like, like relax girl. Like I know people are competitive and stuff, but I feel like Shay is just like, but Shay comes with the looks. Shay um, definitely has, she uses her platform in a really great way. Do I think she could come back and win? Now, she's another one who won an All-Star. She didn't win on her original season. Do I think Shay could come back and win another All-Stars? As of right now, I don't see it. Um... I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I, I just, I mean, any of them can, can turn it out and, and blow me away. There's not any of them. I mean, they're all winners. So obviously they know what it takes to get there. Um, but the competition is very, very stiff. And Shay, I feel like, I don't think it's going to be because she's, lacking in any area per se I think that she's gonna get in her own way I can see Shay getting in her own head and she's going to sabotage herself but I think that if she can cut loose while still staying focused I can see her creeping creeping up there to the top I can see that I can see that you know what I'm saying <laughs>
So that's the Queens. No, a lot could still change. A lot could still happen. That's where I stand right now on the Queens. Let me know in the comment section down below who is your favorite Queen? Who do you want to win? Do you like the new format of All Stars? Do you feel like there's too many drag race situations happening? Can you keep up? Do you watch other countries? Let me know all that stuff in the comment section down below. Anyways, um, if you want to hear my podcast, go ahead and you can listen well wherever you get your podcast. Um, we just finished. We, <laughs> I just finished season two of the podcast. Season three will be back before you know it. So you have a t you have a chance to catch up. Go binge watch, and then you can start being on caught up when season three of the podcast comes. Anyways, that's all I have to say for today. And I will. Um, I guess I'll. See see and talk to you little drag queens um in the next season just kidding in the next episode i'll be back next wednesday yeah i'm gonna go all right love you kids love